right, this is Mofo See That, and I, well, we have something to show you. Who's the other person? Let me show you. Do you know this guy? If not, why not go check him out? I mean, he is a freaking great reviewer. And you might want to pause this. Well, this video. Not this. Pause this video. And go to this one right here. Just, I don't know. Watch the entire thing from beginning to end. Then come back to here. And see what I have to say. I mean, he's... He's a pretty good reviewer, man. I mean, he's got like over a thousand subscribers. But, as of right now, he hasn't gotten a lot of new subscribers or views on his videos. Which is kind of weird, because yeah, that's pretty good stuff. And, sorry if I repeat myself, but he has some pretty good stuff. <laughs> Let me find the video right now. Ooh. Ooh, wait a minute. I just saw something good. Oh, no, I'm not going to hey let you see the entire Harris. video, though. Here with my next review. Still continuing my reviews for Autobot 552. This is my review of the Bakuryu Gun Tie. Yes. Deluxe Power. Killer Row from Bakuryu Sentai Power Super Sentai. This is... The... Ooh, ooh, this is Kitaro set with two ooh, Bakuryu yeah. owned by Abare Killer, Dr. Miko. Has common rider stuff. Hey guys, KRX50 here, and as a celebration to my, and just to wrap up my re-reviewing of the first of my first re reviews of the first three items in the Deno Henshin series, I'm making a, an addendum video to my Denkaman Sword review, where I'll basically be showing off the sounds and giving you a better look at the toy. He has blade, bay blades. Hey guys, KRX50 here with another review. Ooh. Now just to tell you guys, this is a review of something that's rather new to me. That's actually only like a couple of days old. And I'm telling you this because I have not stopped doing reviews of that older stuff that I recently found. It's just that newer stuff takes higher priority. So anyway, this time I'll be reviewing Lightning El Drago from Beyblade Metal Fusion. This is an oh, attack type bay used by the villain character Ryuga on the show. This is Project Blade Beyblade. Hey guys, here is another entry for Project Beybell. Mm, this time requested cool. by 151. It will be Storm Pegasus versus Dark Wolf using two ripcord launchers. Yes. SH Figure Arts. Hey guys, KRX here with another review. This time I'll be reviewing the SH Figure Arts One Piece Portcast D Ace. Portcast D Ace, also known as Fire Fist Ace, is the second division commander of the White Beard Pirates, and by adopting the older brother of the main character of One Piece, Monkey D. Luffy. He first appears at the end of the Drum Island arc, trying to give Luffy a message, but misses him as he's leaving. He then makes his next appearance and first major appearance in the early part of the Alabasta arc, where he's still searching for Luffy. Alright, Aaron, I'm just starting up this one again. But. I don't know. Just. Hey guys, Karen, go check him out. Go and look at some of his videos. They're video. pretty good. I you might find something you like. Why not? Subscribe to him. Like him. Favorite him. 
so give them a comment on these videos. Why not? It's not like you're gonna run out of space in your subscriber bar. Go ahead, check them out, man. Do it right now. Stop this video. Why the hell are you even 